Guys, trust me when I say this. Do not come to Doi Inthanon National Park in monsoon season. In today's video, I'm gonna be showing you why some places in Thailand aren't to be visited during monsoon season. How do you feel? I'm very unhappy. Oh, why are you unhappy? Because I'm freezing. Baby, where are you going? There's a second pagoda, there's a twin pagoda. I'll see you not get out. That's the second pagoda, people, that you can't see. And we're gonna be visiting one of the most incredible waterfalls here. It's enormous from down here. <laughs> Before taking a flight over to Krabi, where we continue our travels across Thailand. Krabi. And so this is my last breakfast at this amazing hotel. I've got some smashed avocado with salmon and a beautiful, delicious smoothie. And I get to enjoy this amazing breakfast period just before we check out and spend our day at Doi Inthanon, which is really, really exciting. But this evening, we're flying to Krabi. Big day ahead. Honestly, what would I do without you? <laughs> like... I'm there enjoying breakfast this morning while my girlfriend is just basically organizing my entire life, packing the suitcases. Today's plan, what is it? Scoot. Scoot, and this is your scooter, of course. Turquoise, matching the uh, your bracelet. Mm. Cute. And where are we going to? National Park. Yes, Doi Inthanon National Park, which is about a two hour scoot over there. We are a little bit pushed for time, but hopefully the 125cc bikes will get us there. No problem at all. Yeah. Let's go. Safety first. Fun second. Never had this before. We had a big head. Okay, off we go. Off we go. Woo! And so after around an hour and 20 minutes on the scooters, we finally made it to Doi Inathon National Park, but we're not actually there yet because we are gonna make our way first over to a waterfall. But on the way, we've stopped off at Wat Namtok Mai Klang, I think it is, this incredible temple. We just noticed it on the side of the road and we were like, wow, it is so beautiful here. And I can't lie, that is unreal. What are you doing, sweetie? Trying to get tickets. Registering us for Taylor Swift. Taylor Swift tickets. Right, so I'm here in Thailand enjoying this natural beauty, this incredible country that we're only here for three weeks and Jenny's more occupied with her phone trying to get in a queue for Taylor Swift tickets. I think every girl on the planet can relate to me. How was the scooter ride? Noisy. Noisy as Flies anything. in my eyes yeah. and I'm sweating. What would your tips be to people if they're gonna hire a scooter? Wear um, earplugs. Yeah, I would definitely agree Take with them that. ones that they give you on the flight. Yeah. Um, and definitely wear sunglasses. Yeah. It is It is a lot, honestly. I actually see a few Thai people at the red lights. You see them with earplugs in. It is incredibly loud on these scooters. Uh, with the wind blowing, but also make sure you do have a pair of sunglasses because otherwise you will be squinting like this the whole way. And also bring a snack because it is a fair way up here. How's mm. the protein bar? Let's go! So on our way up, we had to pick up some tickets to allow us to take our scooters up there to Wachirathan Waterfall and the summit, which is the Doi Inathan National Park with the two famous stupas um, that you're all very well aware of. And we're really looking forward to getting up there. We don't have a huge amount of time, so uh, we'll make it happen. Absolutely. Where have you just been? Um, to the bathroom, which had no tissue. I brought some of my own. Top travel tip, bring some tissues with you if you want to use public toilets because I don't think they provide them, especially ladies out there. Where are we? There. The waterfall. Um, 
and we have made it to one of the best waterfalls in the Doi Inathon National Park. This is Wacharithan Waterfall, which is probably the most spectacular of the many waterfalls at this national park. It is absolutely enormous, around 40 meters high. It's included in your ticket cost to the national park. And guys, I've got to say, if you're going to do any of the waterfalls, this is the one to do. It is absolutely remarkable. You can't swim in it though, for obvious reasons, because you'd probably die and we wouldn't want that to happen. But my God, that is really something special. What do you think? It's, <laughs> it's so really pretty. Nice. It's so pretty. I just hope it does it justice. I know, camera. I know. It's so sick. It is, it's enormous from down here. <laughs> and actually, it's more scary because it's like forceful, isn't it? How do you feel? I'm very unhappy. Oh, why are you unhappy? Because I'm freezing, look. No. I can't feel my hands. Same. Mine are literally numb. Guys, we've made it to Doi Inthanon National Park, which is the highest point in the whole of Chiang Mai, but to be honest, I'm not entirely sure this is the place to be during monsoon season. As you can see, the visibility is terrible. It is freezing cold. My fingers are numb. And quite honestly, this, this isn't fun. I don't think this is enjoyable. It's shocking. We're basically in a cloud. Let's just get this done. I'm not sure it's going to be worth it, but let's just make a move and get it over and done with. Baby, I don't like this at all. You don't like this at all? I don't like the fact that my fingers have gone yellow. Same. This is horrible. We're Simpsons. <laughs> <laughs> go, 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 run, run, run. I think the only way to warm up at Doyenthanon National Park is just running up the stairs when you get here because this is absolutely freezing cold. It's got to be about five, 10 degrees Celsius, especially with the humidity. That's being generous. Yeah. Especially with the rain. Oh God, this isn't good. This would be lovely in the sunshine. Yep. Watch me go flying. <laughs> Watch. That'll be the next thing. Oh, so much information and I just don't have time to read it. Why? Because no, we're late. Because we're late. We're late because we have to catch a flight from Chiang Mai Airport over to Krabi and our flight is at 7 p.m. So we need to be there for latest 5.30 and it is now 10 past three and it's going to take two hours to get back to Chiang Mai. So we've only actually got 15 minutes, 10, 15 minutes here at Doi Inthanon. That's really cutting it fine. I think I'll do the schedule from now on. <laughs> ah, okay. So we've got to drive down. Yeah. Five yeah. minutes? Five, yes. Guys, we're not even in the right area for the pagodas. We've just come to the summit for no reason. So we need to run back up. Let's go. I'm going to kill him. I'm going to kill him. This has literally gone from bad to worse. We're in the wrong place. We're in a nightmare. I don't even know if we're going to have time to see it. Oh, you better make time. We've just driven <laughs> up into the skies. We're into the sky. This is quite literally the clouds. I've got hypothermia. Oh, no. I look ridiculous. Yeah. I literally cannot feel my fingers to get this cash out. Yeah. Let's go. So you've actually got to buy two extra tickets, one each, to see the pagodas. Just to enter the national park, you've got to pay 300 baht each for adults. But to uh, get to the pagodas again, you've got to buy extra tickets. I really hope this is worth it because my god it's been an absolute journey to get here and my fingers are like they've never been this cold you can really feel as you're driving up the temperature difference it goes from boiling hot down in chiang mai to entering the mountain it gets to like five degrees i'm freezing right now how are you feeling honestly yeah i hope this is worth it because you will never hear the end of it if it's not boyfriends out there just uh be cautious bringing yeah. your missus in monsoon oh, season because yeah. either way you'll be responsible <laughs> it's your fault like it always is you're learning say it you can't even see you it. can't even see the pagoda that is the pagoda guys trust me when i say this do not come to doi inthanon national park in monsoon season when it is cloudy like this <laughs> yeah, it's funny. 
These are the pagodas that we came to visit. It is quite literally 10 meters away from me and we can't see it. We just paid to see that. We paid to <laughs> see that. An extra 100 baht each. This is like it's some kind of sick joke. Someone is having us on. I can't believe it. Yeah. The waterfall was amazing. Gotta say that, but are you kidding me? You can't even see the tourists that are like five meters in front of us. Yeah, what are you doing now? Dragging me up there anyway? This has got to be the biggest disappointment of the trip so far. Yeah, you're very, very close to being single. Is that it? <laughs> what? <gasps> <laughs> oh, we have to laugh. We have to laugh. Guys, we're at the top of Doyenathon in Thanon National Park, whatever it's called. I don't even care what oh, it's called. Oh, look at the view though. Oh, the view though. Wow. The view. Get me out of here. This Get me out. has been horrific and, and honestly a terrible experience. We've got a flight to catch. Hopefully Krabby is prettier than this. Without a shadow of a doubt, it will be. Let's head back on these bikes and hopefully we're gonna have enough fuel to get back oh. because that's the next obstacle <laughs> the we need to get through. Thing. Let's find a petrol station. Right, we need a gas station ASAP because we are pretty much running on empty, on <laughs> empty stomachs and also empty gas. Let's go. Gas sounds like you've got a gassy bum. Empty stomachs and empty gas. <gasps> I'm delusional. Is there something in the air up in Boyanthanon? Does anybody know? Let me know in the comments. <laughs> My girlfriend's odd. Yeah, I don't trek you up a mountain in the fog to look at things that you can't see. Baby, where are you going? There's a second pagoda, there's a twin pagoda. Absolutely not, get out. That's the second pagoda, people, that you can't see. But look at my fingers. That is how cold they are. If you come at the correct time of the year, the pagodas do look absolutely spectacular. I'm gonna insert some footage, some photos of what it looks like in summer. So if it is a bright day, guys, definitely come and visit this place because it is obviously worth it. It is a spectacular sight, but do not bother wasting one of your precious travel days here in Chiang Mai to see mist, fog, and clouds. Oh my lord, this is the fuel situation. We have quite literally gone all that way on an empty tank. Yes, it's worked. Oh Thank god. god for that, I'm so happy. No. I was literally convinced we weren't gonna make it. Are we gonna get this flight? Um, at this rate, no. <laughs> Bye bye, thank you, bye bye. Wow, we might have just made it. Our flight is in 50 minutes and we've just got to the airport. We need to get to Krabby, but we need to find our luggage. Run, run, run. Hello. Everything's there, oh my God. Thank you so much, see you soon. Run, run, run. Hello. Thank you. Can you take that off, please? Relax. We're here. In good time. It's not even started boarding yet. I actually still feel dizzy from that scooter ride. Do you? I'm stunned. I'm completely I'm confused. Stunned. I feel like I'm in a dream state still with the adrenaline. We've just with been in Mario Kart. Mario Kart driving through the roads of Chiang Mai, Doyanathon National Park. But we have made it and I'm so happy about that. <laughs> now we need to relax. What have you got there? All the goodies. What is this? Check it. Almond croissant. <laughs> Thank you. I look like a tomato. <laughs> you doing the boyfriend jobs? Boyfriend tasks. <laughs> Someone's got to do it. And she's not. Nope. Next stop. Crabby. my 
bags and I'm carrying your backpack. Cute. Your one bag and my one, two, three, four, five, six. Look at me, I'm burnt to a crisp. You match the colour of your case. Yeah. On today's episode of Why You Should Wear Sun Cream. Mind your stuff. You never wear it. <laughs> Light. I can do it with one hand, obviously. Okay, good, because here's mine, so back to this. Oh, that one. Light work, don't worry about it. Is it light? I mean, your toiletry bag's in it, so no. Or your lotions and potions. Babe, <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> Fine, let's go to the hotel. Are you ordering a grab, babe? You've just done it, babe. No, of course you're not. I'm on grab duty. I'm on all you're duties. Because you my boyfriend. You do the boyfriend tasks. <laughs> I do every task in this relationship. All grab duties. I all, decorate um, it. Yeah, you decorate it. You just look nice and add the garnishings to the exactly. main dish. You exactly. Know? Baby, it looks like we're not getting a grab. Instead, we're jumping in a uh, shuttle bus for 80 baht per person to the city centre. Does that work? Does that work? That'll be an experience. Get me in my room. Okay, cool, thank you. Yeah. Two tickets. Go on, babe. Pay the lady. You pay the lady. No, of course not. <laughs> I'll, I'll pay the lady. Yeah, you will. Now, if you order a grab from Krabby Airport, you're going to be waiting a long time, but there are a lot of shuttles taking people to all the different areas of Krabby. So you're just going to jump on a shuttle with everyone else. 80 baht per person. Can't go wrong. Oh, we are literally the last people to get dropped off. They dropped off about eight people before us. And it's taken, how long to get here? 40 minutes? Should have just waited for a cab. Don't get shared shuttles, unless you want to save. How much? 100 baht? Two quid? This is our stop. Get Should out. I get out? Yeah. <laughs> here we go. All right, let's see. Let's check the room. <gasps> Okay, okay, not too bad. So, you know, coming from some of the top hotels that we've been staying in so far to this, it is a little bit different, but we are only here for one night. So this is gonna work for us. I cannot wait for next week's video where we're gonna be staying in one of the best hotel chains in the entire world. I'm so, so excited about it. You guys have to subscribe to the channel though if you wanna see what that's gonna be. I cannot wait. Do not miss it. Do not Do miss not. it. Do not. So fun. Anyway, let's get some food. And that is the restaurant that we're trying to get to. It closes in 10 minutes and we're about a 10 minute walk away. Today has just been a full day of <laughs> rushing we're around. Idiot. Right, idiots. Oh, the restaurant. It's 11 o'clock. Please serve food. Oh, so it's closed. Last orders. Okay, so it looks like tonight's dinner spot is going to be where? 7-Eleven. We're at 7-Eleven because all the restaurants have just closed. So, I mean, I've heard great things about the toasties, so I'm just going to get one of these. Croissant, what do you think about that? Tuna no. <laughs> salmon. Mmm. 7-Eleven toasty. I'm not sure what all the fuss is about. I'm going to wash it down with some alcohol. And we are back in the hotel in Krabby. And I had a lovely dinner at 7-Eleven. How was your Delicious dinner? Delicious and nutritious. But this is where I'm gonna wrap up today's video. So if you have enjoyed it, hit the like button and also subscribe to the channel for the weekly uploads and hit the bell notification button to ding get notified dong. for the ding dong, for the bing bong. <laughs> I am deliriously tired and that is why I'm closing off this video and I'll see you guys tomorrow or in the next one or whenever I see you next. Bye-bye.